Obviously, Tom, you've been out for some time now with an injury. Um, for anyone who is maybe not familiar with your situation or, or people who are new to Cage Warriors, um, probably something you don't want to particularly relive, but if you could cast your mind back uh, and explain what happened with your injury, how it happened, what happened, and uh, you know what's been going on. Yeah, basically, I was uh, preparing for my Cage Warriors debut, and um, yeah, I was yeah, sparring, and my knee got caught in an awkward situation and uh, tore my ACL. Um, ended up having the surgery uh, a few months later, and it's uh, like an eight to nine month rehab process. Um, done the rehab, knee's better than ever. And I'm, I'm back. We've seen you. Um, we've seen you at Cage Warriors in Jordan last time. Obviously, coming out with Dave Hill, you're out with yeah. Dave again. Uh, how has it been for you? Um, you know, sort of coming out and, and you know warming your guy up and everything, and, and surely thinking, you know, wish that was yeah, me. In there. Yeah, for sure. I, you know, I, I, uh, I'm thinking about that all the time. I mean, it's good preparation for me being uh, being around the uh, like visualize. I get to visualize while while Dave's uh, out here to fight, uh, ready to fight and stuff. So yeah. When you finally, you know, got back to the gym for the first time, yeah. and, and you were first able to, you know, really let loose and have a proper training session, you know, how, how must that have felt? You know, what was going yeah. through your mind? Yeah, it's, it's one of the best feelings ever. I've, you know, I can't. I've been waiting so long to, to um, to get back onto the mat and train. You know, I was there was a lot of depression, you know, during the injury and stuff. But you know, it's made me a stronger, stronger fighter. So, so I mean, in terms of of actually coming back now, um, I know there's been sort of a few dates that have been talked about. In, in your mind. Uh, how long do you think it's going to be until you're ready to step in the cage and fight? And, and what are you kind of aiming for in that I'm, respect? I'm ready to fight now. I'm just waiting for cage warriors. Uh, I'm looking at, at November. Yeah, I'm ready to fight. I feel, feel great. So, yeah. yeah, there's been a lot going on in your division. Yeah. You know, uh, your last fight was, was a fantastic performance against Warren Key yeah. uh, back in 2012. In cage warriors, particularly, your division's really been heating up. What are your thoughts on the, on the division and, and, and the champ and some of the guys who are yeah, making waves it's, now? It's, it's very exciting. Um, you know, there's there's so many different styles, uh, so many exciting matchups. I, I can't wait to uh, to fight these guys. So yeah, I wanna I wanna definitely uh, make my mark on the division as soon as I as soon as I step into it. And of course, K Troy is now broadcast on Channel Four, so yeah. that must be a big incentive yeah. to get back yeah, and sure. uh, get your face on TV yeah. for the fans back home. Yeah, on. for sure. It's uh, K Troy is growing all the time, so you know it's uh, gonna be great to be a part of the, the journey. Well, fingers crossed. Tom will be back in the K Troy's cage. Before the end of this year, in the meantime, follow him on Twitter and of course follow us on Twitter at Cage Warriors. Get us on Facebook, Cage Warriors Fighting Championship, and of course, Channel 4 every Tuesday after the Cage Warriors event for all the Cage Warriors event highlights.